Tom Ford is one of my favorite high-end designer brands when it comes to fragrances. They have some bangers out there. I do like Neroli, Portofino, Tobacco Vanille, Tuscan Leather. When it comes to one of the more hyped up Tom Ford fragrances, this fragrance was released in 2017, and this is none other than fabulous. God damn. Now to me, this was an exclusive fragrance by Tom Ford. This was very hyped up. This is fabulous. The initial blast of this, you get hit with lavender leather. I get leather right off the top, a little bit of clary sage mixed in there. There's some tonka bean develops. After a few minutes of this, you know what I get hit with? It turns from fabulous to Shit. The notes are clary, sage, lavender, pity, almond, leather, the loris, the bean, cashmere, and white amber. You know what this smells like? This turns literally, literally, into pampers, into huggies, into diapers, into baby diapers, maybe adult diapers. You know what? Diapers that haven't been shat in. I'll give you that. I'm not even going to spray this right now. You know why? Because I'm still trying to scrub it off my arm. So I'll show you what I'm going to do here. I'm going to do this. Get this. Take this and goodbye, right in the trash. That's what I think of Tom Ford's fabulous. Hey, no, I'm gonna tell you something. Let me tell, <laughs> let me, <t> no, let me, <laughs> let me tell you something, hold on. You know when you smell <laughs> the clears and the cashmere, <laughs> Ah. Now I know there's gonna be haters. There's always gonna be haters. There's gonna be people that love this. They love the sophistication of it. They're like, hey man, your nose isn't developed. You don't understand fabulous. You don't get the, the clary sage and the lavender and the Tuscan leather base, leather foundation makes this a miracle and the tonka bean, oh no. You know what this smells like? It smells like baby diapers. And I'll tell you what, I don't wanna smell like baby diapers. And once you smell this, you might not get it right off, but when you get that note of diaper, it's game over. Do you want your girl to smell like diapers? Does your girl want you to smell like diapers? I don't want someone that smells like some bitch huggies. Oh, hey, babe, Kss, let's smell like huggies. Now, normally I would do an extra couple sprays. Today, we're not doing that. Okay, calm down. You know what? I'm being a little bit hard, okay? It's not, it, it's bad. I don't like it. It's not for me. It's not fabulous. They're playing off the hype of the name. Yes, this name is going to draw attention. It's going to draw a crowd. It drew me. That's why I blind bought this and I don't like it. It's not terrible. It's okay. You might be able to grow into it. Why would you want to have a fragrance that's challenging that you might like one day? We all have that. People who collect fragrances, we have fragrances that we eventually grow to like. But for me, this isn't one of them. Okay, the initial blast, it's almondy and leather right off. The leather reminds me a little bit of the Tuscan leather. This doesn't smell like Tuscan leather, but I can smell the leather that's in Tuscan leather was probably used in this. Leather, right off the bat, lavender, almond. I get the clary sage mixing in and the tonka bean comes in. It's just a mess. This, this fragrance to me is a pure mess. Poor shit. I don't know. You might like it. Let me know in the comments. If you have this or if you smell this, I want to hear your argument. For me, this isn't a winner. This one doesn't do it for me, but if you love it, let it work for you. And it's expensive, right? This is a signature Tom Ford line. So you're paying, you know, $280 retail for the 50 ml size. That's really expensive for a fragrance that's kind of good. It's almost like they had to overcompensate like the guys with the giant trucks, right? If that's you, but you know, they name it fabulous because it's not that good. 87% of you are not subscribed to the channel, but you're watching. I'm watching you. Who would wear something like this? Somebody that would wear fabulous is somebody that wants to get slapped on the first date or never called back again. No woman is going to smell this on a guy and be like, oh, he smelled so good. He just has that huggy vibe. Those pampers. It just makes me want to have a baby so I can change their diaper and then smell my husband and they all smell the same. And no guy is going to smell a woman and go, man, you know what? That reminds me of Uncle Ted's Depends. Mmm, she gets a second date. This one's a pass for me. You know what? Cut the video. No, duh, cut the video. We're done. This is the Fragrance Channel. Thanks for stopping by.